Dali Yulandanu Garatan Temple Dali Yulandanu Garatan Temple is dedicated to the goddess of the lake as Idagatari Yulandanu on the edge of a huge crater. Dali Yulandanu Garatan Temple is a temple dedicated to the goddess of the lake as Idagatari Dui Yulandanu on the edge of a huge crater. The dominant shrines are Maru's pagodas, dedicated to the lake goddess and the gods of Mount Better and Mount Gunungagun, the largest volcano in Bali. The temple was built in the 17th century in worship of the main Hindu trinity, Brahma Vishnu Shiva, as well as the lake goddess, Duyudanu. The site and cool atmosphere of the Bali uplands have made the lake and this temple a favorite sightseeing and recreational spot as well as a frequently photographed site. Yulandanu Biratan Temple, literally the source temple of Lake Biratan, is easily the island's most iconic sanctuary sharing the scenic qualities with the seaside temples of Yuluwadu Temple and Tongalot Temple. The smooth reflective surface of the lake surrounding most of the temple's base creates a unique floating impression, while the mountain range of the Baduga region encircling the lake provides the temple with a scenic backdrop. Yulandanu Biratan Temple mostly called as a Yulandanu Temple but not to be confused with Yulandanu Better Temple, which is on the rim of the caldera at Batter Lake. It is especially important for the Balinese. Only here can you get holy water of a particular variety. The water is collected from the lake itself, directly in front of the temple. Visitors have to wear a sash and not go near. Bathing is forbidden. The lake is the ultimate source of water for the rivers and springs that irrigate central Bali. It is therefore of the utmost importance. The temple priests say that the lake is fed by springs located at each of the wind directions. Each of the springs is the origin of water for that particular region of central Bali. So, farmers from north Bali collect their holy water from the northern spring of the lake and so on. Yulandanu Temple lies by the western banks of Lake Braden in the Bidugal Highlands at a level of well 39 m, is one of the most picturesque and most photographed temples in Bali. Yulandanu is inside the caldera of the now extinct volcano Gunung Kadar. It is one of the main sources of irrigation in the Balinese Highlands, and so the temple is dedicated to history Yulandanu Biratan Temple. Yulandanu Temple can be traced back to the rise of the Mengwe Kingdom. The name of Yulandanu Biratan Temple is taken from the lake where the temple is built at Biratan Lake. The name of Biratan Lake is inseparable with the Biratan Mount as deity and goddess as fertility source, prosperity to keep the prosperity in life and society life. In Papyrus Chronicle of the Mengwe is elaborated by the history of Yulandanu Biratan Temple founding together with existence of the Mengwe Empire. Therefore its status is pertained with the second hand of Temple Empire what is usually pertained as Dangkayangan. It is the same to the description in Papyrus of the Sanabali and Padmabuwana, hence Punkak Manga Temple where the Pungyawangan representative place to worship, is the Yulandanu Biratan Temple. So it is called by entire Balinese residents as Kayangan Jigat, the biggest group of Hindu temple in Bali. The floating temple complex is comprised of four groups of shrines, including the prominent Lingapetic shrine to its east. There are four gates facing each of the four points of the compass. Yulandanu Biratan Temple is consisted of four temples complex that are 1. Lingapetic Temple owns the function to worship the Siwa God 2. Penetran Pukak Manga Temple is referred to this gate as Paryangan Reaping Earing Rawa Biratan or Danu Biratan Temple is founded by Igusti Agumputu to worship the Hyangang Parwat or deity which is placed in Pukak Manga that is Batar Hyangdanawa as according to Papyrus of Padmabuana and Asanabali, because Manga Mount is located in north direction, hence it is called the Batar Hyangdanawa or Visnu God 3. Tirate Bang Temple is functioning to worship of Brahma God 4. Dalim Purwa Temple is functioning to worship of Danu Goddess which is considered to be miraculous of the Batar Hyangdanawa or Laxmi Goddess. Yulandanu Biratan Temple Ceremony The temple ceremony execution at Yulandanu Biratan Temple is consisted of two types those are 1. The temple ceremony which is executed every 6 month 210 days that on Ang Eratuzdi, Bluwangjilung Wanji based on Balinese Hindu calendar. Every 12 months 420 days is executed by the bigger ceremony from the ordinary ceremony, so called Piyadalanagundu. The Kelim ceremony is executed at any times as according to situation and condition. The Pakelim ceremony owns the function to worship the supremacy and also cheapness of the infinite for award of life, fertility, prosperity, as impact of the existence of ecosystem balance so that give the benefit for life and universe life forever and ever. 
during Veriton Lake and Veriton Mount stand-up.